Eye Protection Systems monitor material movement and critical events in the stamping process. Using the right sensors can prevent misfeeds and die crashes. One of the first sensor designs is the whisker wire or limit switch. The whisker wire only works correctly if the workpiece is in the right position or if it's short fed. With this design, there are some risks. If the workpiece is fed long, the go signal is still sent to the press. If the workpiece is in a high position, the go signal is also sent to the press. If the workpiece is in a low position, the go signal is sent to the press. These risks can cause significant die damage and cost. Masumi has two alternatives to the whisker wire. The Masumi OKJS sensor is able to narrow down in the position of the workpiece compared to the whisker wire. But the potential for failure is in the accuracy of the workpiece contact. If the workpiece is fed long, the go signal is still sent to the press. If the workpiece contacts the sensor and is slightly off target, the go signal is still sent to the press. The second and best alternative is the Masumi OKJB sensor. This design is made of 4140 steel to prevent body breakage and a proximity switch. The OKJB sensor can monitor specific events and, when there is a problem, it can signal the press to stop. The pushing force from the workpiece pushes the shaft in the correct position which signals go to the press. If the workpiece pushes the shaft too far or is long fed, the sensor does not give the go to the press. The same goes for when the workpiece is short fed, no signal is provided to the press. Even if the workpiece contacts the sensor and is slightly off target, no signal is provided to the press. Compared to the whisker wire and OKJS sensors, the Masumi OKJB sensor provides a signal to the press only if the workpiece is in the correct position, saving you precious time and cost. To configure your Masumi OKJB sensor, visit masumi.info forward slash OKJB.